Robin Williams was one of the greatest comics of a generation, making audiences around the world laugh for hours on end. Behind the curtain, though, Williams fought many personal battles, something the actor rarely spoke about publicly. Robin Williams, Come Inside My Mind, which debuted earlier this year at Sundance, explores all aspects of his life, featuring rare footage of the comic alongside new interviews with those close to him. You're only given a little spark of madness and if you lose that, you're nothing, Williams says during the first trailer for the HBO documentary. Steve Martin also makes an appearance in the clip, saying, he was really comfortable on stage. Off stage, I just felt he was holding himself together. Watch above. 1980, Robin Williams in the world famous Mork and Mindy series that launched his career. 1984, Williams in Moscow on the Hudson. The actor earned his first Golden Globe nomination for his turn as a Russian circus performer in this 1984 hit. 1987, Williams in the critically acclaimed Good Morning, Vietnam. Williams ad-libbed all the radio broadcast scenes from this 1987 film about a radio DJ sent to Vietnam to entertain the US troops serving out there. 1989, Robin Williams appeared with Robert Sean Leonard and Josh Charles in Dead Poets Society as English teacher John Keating, or the slightly more daring O Captain, My Captain. 1990, Williams and Robert De Niro in Awakenings, an emotional film that saw Williams portray a British neurologist who administered a drug to catatonic patients that briefly awoke them from decades of catatonia. 1991, Williams appeared as an adult Peter Pan forced to return to Neverland to rescue his children in Hook. The film received mixed reviews but proved popular at the box office. 1992, Williams in Toys. The film followed a military general after he inherits a toy factory and decides to produce war toys. 1993, Williams appeared in one of his best-loved roles in Mrs. Doubtfire, where he played an actor disguising himself as a female housekeeper in order to spend more time with his children. 1995, Williams appeared as man released from a board game after being trapped for decades inside it in the blockbuster Jumanji. 1996, Williams starred opposite Jennifer Lopez in Jack, a film about a young boy who ages four times faster than other children. 1997, Williams appeared alongside Matt Damon in Good Will Hunting, a film that won him an Oscar for his portrayal of psychologist Sean McGuire. As he accepted his award, a touched Williams warned the audience, Oh man, this might be the one time I'm speechless. 1997, the box office hit flubber saw Williams take the role of Professor Philip Brainerd, who creates the unstoppable green goo flubber in his bid to produce a new energy source. 1998, Williams gave a poignant turn as Dr. Hunter Patch Adams, an unqualified doctor who treats patients with laughter in Patch Adams. 1998, Williams stars alongside Cuba Gooding Jr. in What Dreams May Come, a film that follows American physician Chris Nielsen's journey through the afterlife after he is killed in a car crash. 1999, Robin Williams, Bob Balaban, left, and Armin Muller style star in the movie Jacob the Liar about a Jewish shopkeeper who uses his imagination to engender hope throughout a Polish ghetto in 1944. 1999, American science fiction drama Bicentennial Man followed an android, 
Williams, as he experiences emotions and becomes more human 2002. Williams took a more sinister role as reclusive crime writer and murderer Walter Finch in Insomnia. 2002, Williams undertook an unsettling, psychopathic role in One Hour Photo, where he played a photo lab technician obsessed with a family who frequented the store. 2002, Williams starred alongside Danny DeVito in Death to Smoochie, a film about a corrupt children's television host disgraced by an FBI sting. 2005, Robin Williams stars in The Big White, a film about a financially struggling travel agent trying to make a bogus life insurance claim in order to pay for his wife's Tourette treatment. 2006, Williams and Ben Stiller star in Night at the Museum. Williams will appear in upcoming film Night at the Museum, Secret of the Tomb, playing the statue of Teddy Roosevelt who comes to life at night. 2006, Robin Williams, Jeff Daniels and Cheryl Hines star in road trip comedy R.V. Apostrophe, which followed the tribulations of a dysfunctional family. 2006, Williams took the leading role in the political comedy drama Man of the Year about a comedian who decides to run for president and finds himself mistakenly elected. 2007, Robin Williams and Freddie Heimer in August Rush, where Williams played a homeless musician who teaches children living on the streets music and employs them as performers. 2007, Robin Williams, Mandy Moore and John Krasinski starred in License to Wed. Williams played a reverend who places a couple through a series of tests to see if they should marry in his church. The rom-com was poorly received by critics. 2010, Robin Williams and John Travolta star in Old Dogs, a comedy that sees two friends and owners of a sports marketing firm struggle to deal with seven-year-old twins placed in their care. The film was nominated for four Golden Raspberry Awards. 2013, Susan Sarandon, Robert De Niro and Robin Williams star in The Big Wedding 2013, Williams starred as President Eisenhower in Lee Daniels The Butler. 2014, Robin Williams with his Mork and Mindy co-star Pam Dabber in The Crazy Ones series. It was axed after one season. 2014, Rob Williams stars in The Angriest Man in Brooklyn, the story of a bad-tempered man mistakenly told he has 90 minutes to live. Williams took his own life, in 2014, aged 63. For confidential support call the Samaritans in the UK on 08457901990, visit a local Samaritans branch or click here for details. More about Robin Williams, HBO.